by specializing an individual improves their skill at a certain task or a certain job. And in doing so, they build up their productivity and their efficiency, their ability to produce in a shorter amount of time. And in economics, we generally tie productivity with wages. So if somebody's becoming more productive, they're also able to earn more. To consider disadvantages of specialization, you'd have to just put yourself in the shoes of somebody who's specialized for a moment. And I want you to try to think of yourself as a factory worker, as a teacher, and then also as a neurosurgeon. And I'm gonna look at this disadvantage side from each different perspective. So first, if you're working in a factory, you go to work every day, you do the same mundane task, right? It feels meaningless. You're just kind of there putting pieces together, but that's all you do. So if you're going to specialize in doing that, then yes, it can get pretty boring, which can result in you being demotivated. And the other danger to that is you're specialized in a task that could probably be automated. So you'll be replaced by capital equipment or machinery in the near future. And when you go to get a job, you'll find it difficult because you have a skill that can now be done by a machine that doesn't get tired. If you look at it from the perspective of a teacher, you can think about somebody who's teaching the same course to the same year group year on year. Right in the first year or two, it can be exciting, but then after some time, it must wear the individual down. They get bored, demotivated, and then we end up with the same issue as uh, we mentioned before, right? The decrease in productivity. And the final example is the neurosurgeon. So this doesn't equally apply across all different professions. So you'll notice the neurosurgeon is highly specialized, highly rewarded, and I imagine unlikely to get bored in their work. So when you compare the disadvantages of specialization across different fields, be mindful that it doesn't apply equally to everybody.